Internal Revenue Service IRS Tax News. IRS provides further details on additional relief for certain partnerships preparing schedules K2 and K3 for 2021. IR 2022-38 February 16, 2022, Washington. The IRS today provided further details on additional transition relief for certain domestic partnerships and S corporations preparing new schedules K2 and K3 to further ease the change to their new schedules. Those eligible for the relief will not have to file the new schedules for tax year 2021. The new schedules K2 and K3 improve reporting by standardizing international tax information to partners and flow through investors, making it easier for them to report these items on their tax returns. In addition, the changes ease flow through return preparation compliance by clarifying obligations and standardizing the format for reporting. Notice 2021-39, there's a link to that notice here, provides penalty relief for good faith efforts to adopt the new schedules. Today's transition relief appearing in new frequently asked questions, the FAQs on Schedule K2 and K3, there's a link to that here, allows an additional exception for tax year 2021 filing requirements by certain domestic partnerships and as corporations. The IRS is providing an additional exception for tax year 2021 to filing the Schedule K2 and K3 for certain domestic partnerships and as corporations. To qualify for this exception, the following must be met. In tax year 2021, the direct partners in the domestic partnership are not foreign partnerships, foreign corporations, foreign individuals, foreign estates, or foreign trusts. Uh, in tax year 2021, the domestic partnership or S corporation has no foreign activity, including foreign taxes paid or accrued or ownership of assets that generate, have generated, or may reasonably expect to generate foreign source income. See section 1.861-9 G3. In tax year 2020, the domestic partnership or S corporation did not provide to its partnership or shareholders, nor did the partners or shareholders request the information regarded on the form or attached thereto. Line 16, Form 1065, Schedule K and K1. Line 14, Form 1120S and Line 20C, Form 1065, Schedule K and K1. Controlled Foreign Corporations, Passive Foreign Investment Companies, 1120-F, Section 250, Section 864C8, Section 721C Partnerships, and Section 7874, Line 17D4, Form 1120S. The domestic partnership or S corporation has not has no knowledge that the partners or shareholders are requesting such information for tax year 2021. If a partnership or S corporation qualifies for this exception, the domestic partnership or S corporation does not need to file Schedule K2 and K3 with the IRS or with its partners or shareholders. However, if the partnership or S corporation is subsequently notified by a partner or shareholder that all or part of the information contained on Schedule K3 is needed to complete their tax return, then the partnership or S corporation must provide the information to the partner or shareholder. If a partner or shareholder notifies the partnership or S corporation before the partnership or S corporation files its return, the conditions <laughs> for the exception are not met and the partnership or S corporation must provide the Schedule K3 to the partner or a shareholder file the Schedule K2 and K3 with the IRS. So it's just, it's clear as, as clear as can be, I'm sure, to everybody here. If you want to look at that in more detail, we will have links to this in the description and you can, you can, get, you can dive into the details if you think this is going to be applicable uh, to your S corporation and whatnot. And, and so you can start your research here. Uh, last line here, the IRS welcomes additional comments on Schedule K2 and K3. This feedback and inquiries can be sent to, and there's an area you could send to the email address so again, if, you're, if this is applicable to you, you're probably going to need to dive down a little bit more and check into it and uh, see, see what's going on with it, if it's going to be applicable uh, to you. And there'll be a link to this in the description.